Hold it up. Here, let me lighten it up so I can see better. Not bad day of fishing. Get on back there. The camera go again. Me too. I got one right here. Right there, YouTube, uh, here, hang on. Okay. We'll do the YouTube experience. Ready? Okay. Fish on, Bill. Fish on. All right. Yeah, we both caught one. Bass, don't lose them, don't lose them. Oh, wow. That's a big one. Wow. One pound. Hello, this is Wild Bill's Adventures Outdoor. Hey, in the past I showed you uh, a packet collapsible eagle claw uh, open face and I sh and demonstrate that and all that. I got me a, a fly rod, eagle claw, uh, collapsible little packet uh, travel thing. So we're going to try this out and, see, and I'm going to go bass fishing and I went ahead and got a little heavier line for it, for the bass and the uh, line does not come with it when you buy it in the package, so you have to go and get your deal. Bass Pro is the place to go. They'll set stuff up for you. If I brought my uh, fishing rod over there, they would have put all the line on there for you, what you buy. But I didn't brought my pole, so I, I did it up myself. Well, let's see what happened. Oh yeah, the, it's six foot and six inches is the pole and uh, the weight is three three pounds or something like that I get all this float line out Come out six foot and six inches. Is what you call a stripping line. So you strip the line, kind of mimic like the, the frog. I got a frog on there.
be careful. <laughs> There's a hole right there. Thanks. <laughs> That's not good. Fish hit it. I messed up. I messed up. Yeah. That's a sign. Yes. At least it's working. You just I gotta catch it. Oh yeah. That was it's a challenge catching that bass on a fly rod for me. But we gotta try it out. That was good, one hit it. I would have cut the hook, I would have got him. But I messed up, I didn't expect it to hit. I, that thing just stopped and it just came up where I wanted to stop it. Ooh, I stepped on the line, that didn't help. Put that down just a hair. So you get all the action on the ground. Actually, I can bring it up closer. So you can see the action. Fish on! Got me a perch. <laughs> Got me a little perch. <laughs> all right. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I missed the bass, but I caught me a perch. That's even better. This is just, at least I caught something with it. Uh, there we go. Look at that. Oh, got me a perch. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm gonna put the bluegill back in the water. We catch something else. I wish I caught that bass, so I messed up on the bass. But I get the, did got the, ah, I did got the uh, perch off the fly rod. It hit again. I was messing with the camera. It was, looked like a perch. Not a perch. Slack at that. Get the line on slack. Don't want all that slack in there. I want to miss it like I did that bass. Come on, bat. Come on, bass or, or bluegill. I don't care. Just fun. Just catching with that fly rod. Something different. Not very good at fly fishing yet. And anybody see what I'm doing wrong, uh, leave information for me and let me know what I need to fix. Oh, there was a fish just went for it. Uh, leave the information. Leave the information there for me and, uh, and let me know what I need to do to fix my fly fishing. I came up to it, but I didn't bite it he just came up to it it's working great 
This works the popper worked better than that frog. Or maybe just because I'm on this side where there's more shade with the sun out too by the tree here. But this is a hot spot right now. I noticed I just let it set for a little bit, move a little bit, set for a little bit. It'll start attacking even if it's not moving. Nothing this time. Right there, where you see the branch underneath the, right at, close to the water, there's a fish jump up right there. And I don't know. I got an action on a fish. I got to angle up right here. Dang. Put that fish in there. After that, got caught up in that tree. I don't know if I spooked that fish or not. I got fish on. And now I got snag. Of course. No. Yes. Ah, oh, no. Dang. Are you kidding me? What? Ah. Nothing goes right. So close to that fit bass, and I can't get it. <sighs> this time I'll just go get my waders. A lot easier to go out there, up, up through here. I will say the Claw Eagle uh, fly rod is pretty good when I caught that bird, uh, but that's all right. I'm going to try it one more time right back where I caught that perch and see if I catch anything. I miss the bass way down the very end where I brought you up in the water. I miss another bass and another perch up there. I got I see what they were, but you know what? I'll, I'll do more demonstration with this pole uh, fly fishing. 
um, and uh, keep trying at it. It's a little bit uh, harder than I thought. Trying to catch a bass off a fly rod. It's more challenging. I'll say that much. We'll see what happens. That was a perch too. Had too much slack in there and he attacked my line instead of the, the bait. A little popper. Just keep on downsizing it. Give you a little bit of time. Fish just jumped there. I don't know. There we go. Then you got to put it away. Well, we'll do it another time. I got things to do. Keep on hitting like and subscribe, and and I hope you enjoy the show. We'll keep on doing more adventures.